all right guys for kage here and welcome back to the brand new video here we are again on one punch man world so i was just uploading and working on my daily routine video that will drop today but uh, it will be a little bit postponed because this one will drop sooner than any other video because as a content creator i need to address this and show to everyone what the developers or the publisher whatever what they're doing to the global players and that is truly truly embarrassing and i am disappointed overall and now i will go into more details i believe definitely this will be a big deal and they're gonna have to address it they're gonna fix it somehow i don't know how but uh, yeah i'm doing now auto mode uh, farming blah 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 but let me now go into the into this part okay so shout out to kaku shout out to some of you who comment on my latest video i will show you everything uh but pretty much let me go on the kaku uh, twitter page people are getting banned like crazy what is happening okay here we are on kaku's twitter page and this is what is happening okay this is what is happening people are getting banned for re-rolling believe it or not everyone who re-rolled who created multiple accounts blah 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 got banned i saw many people commenting that please tell me that now in the comment section below from your experience what happened that would be tremendously helpful so if you, if you can put a comment with your own experience and what happened to you did you got banned for, because of re-rolling the one big deal one big deal is that re-rolling is a normal thing in any type of gacha game that's why even them created a re-roll banner but it's only pay to win plus you have to give a chance to the normal player especially with this game that gives such a low amount of summoning currency such a low rates the same problems like we already discussed in the close beta okay and some people want to be free to play and without free to play players there is no player base because the whales won't shine then okay so you need to give us the chance that we reroll for at least that first ssr and it's a painful reroll it takes million of times let me say it like that to get an first ssr so now they're banning players for actually re-rolling that's disgraceful that's like the disgusting disgusting i believe that's the word to use and i'm highly disappointed hopefully they're gonna address this but the big deal is here i have paid for it and yet i get banned what 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 the f is wrong with this game so some people paid for the reroll banner they rerolled but they also rerolled uh for the right account you know they also rerolled for getting that ssr character and they also paid then to get additional ssr character and for this type of stuff because of rerolling i believe deleting creating multiple accounts they 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 know and they ban you what a disgrace <laughs> what a disgrace bro okay let we keep let we keep on um, let, let's keep searching one more thing there should be somewhere uh by the way global blue lock that will be one of the videos uh, but here it is first of all i believe there are 10 million pre-registrations i don't know bro it, it sounds sketchy honestly it is sketchy how many followers they have orally on their social media and everything else i don't know S some of the comments said that they don't believe they got 10 million pre-registrations they did crazy amount of ads i can tell right away so maybe truly there was 10 million pre-registrations but only 2 million people downloaded the game very suspicious very suspicious with the amount of pre-registrations overall i honestly believe that the real number is not more than two three four million i believe they they they, they i don't know how they done it i i don't want to go into that i don't want to put any like accusations here but definitely it's sketchy that's all what i can say the revenue they've done in like a few days of the game launch is 100k so if there was 10 million downloads there was uh, if there was 10 million pre-registrations definitely definitely it was low amount of downloads then 
and the rev revenue especially guys while we at it i thought that i will do part two summoning video for tornado but i looked at those packs and nothing is worth buying like generally i don't see a pack worth buying except a battle tier pack and something like that that, that multi that i bought and that's it everything else it is just not worth it you will just get shafted most of the time so huge huge problems with this banning and this part i already addressed the summoning part from the from the close battle guys let me go into in, in on, on my channel here let me go one punch man world and if I scroll, I also done the close battle videos. And in the close battle videos, you had like crazy amount of summons, like 200 plus summons I've done. The last day I've done 600 plus summons. And the amount of, uh, here in the close battle, the pity was 90, okay? So a little bit different story, but still, I had 600 plus summons. 600 plus summons. And I only pulled a few SSRs. From that point, I always was talking about that the rates will be the problem. The currency, I thought we will get much more, but no. No, they, they lowered so much that it's crazy. I enjoy the game. I play the game daily. I grind the game. I absolutely enjoy the game, but that part of the packages, even as a pay-to-win, it's like, whatever. You, you, it's not even worth buying. Um, I would. If there was packs worth buying, I would spend 300 200 euros it doesn't matter i would spend it because i enjoy the game but the packages are not worth it i'm not getting literally nothing from it except shaft with losing the money <laughs> yeah overall i need to say it like this uh, but yeah gameplay uh, models uh, ani um, animations i love it i absolutely love it i'm addicted to this game but if they don't address the ban banning part if they don't address and the rates if they don't address this important stuff the game will just die and that's like from my experience i already know this type of stuff for 100 percent, there's no doubt about this that the game will die even i need to say this even in devil may cry peak of combat which is like full of scams the, the, that part is like legit law problem scams <laughs> i need i need to say it like that literally, literally they had the lucky roulette event where it says like two of them are with normal gems spins and the rest of them with pay gems and literally everyone got the same rewards in first two free to play spins so it was coded full on scam even though they said it's a random so i'm just saying there is even worse parts but i, I want to say that one uh, devil mccry peak of combat at least if you want to be paid to win you have a really decent prices and you can get a bunch of stuff honestly you can get a bunch of stuff this game doesn't offer that i'm free to play on uh, devil may cry peak of combat because of so many reasons they've done even so much more behind the scenes so i don't want to support them at all here they predicted in one punch man world crazy I, I love the game i love the game but that disgusting part about the rerolls about scamming people i'm not saying that but it looks weird that the game had 10 million pre-registrations and the packages pay to win packages huge problem rates and uh pity just give us more summon currency that's it like okay trust me the games won't change the pity and the summoning system how they release it i can 99 percent 99999 they always leave it no matter what communities say so forget about that part focus on getting to ask them as much as possible summon currency they're gonna need to do it or the game will just die really quickly the game will die just re really quickly plus they really released the new banner uh, in about three days from the release uh, they're really going all in for money there is also a package for 1000 euros that is 90 percent discount or, or something like that uh, so you can buy it for 100 euros but again it doesn't give you nothing special bro like no joke nothing special okay uh, that's that guys love ya hope you did enjoy the video uh rent video i don't know what's happening with recent games but they just flop for such a lame reasons unprofessional reasons i need to say really unprofessional behaviors really unprofessional behaviors and this is just a message to every de not developer but even the publisher just focus on 
why this these days the games become just like a cash grabs even those sh beautiful animated graphic models the game that should last overall they screw it up for unprofessional reasons and it's a message people are knowing this they they you cannot do for long companies people are gonna notice you're gonna die off so definitely do things better okay do things better bye guys